hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my channel and you know that i had a tutorial which is the threshold effect portrait with a brush that means uh, uh, this one i made this one august 23 2016 that means when i uh, decided to start the youtubing or um, make the video tutorial about photoshop or like that uh, at that time i just uh, made that tutorial and uh, which is not uh, too much professional uh, that was no voice uh, in a background and everything is uh, not too much professional and um, that doesn't help you out to uh, make learning so the, though this one got um, the 914k that means almost 1 million view but uh, in this 2020 in a, in a lockdown situation and the pandemic situation i decided to make this tutorial again with the voice and proper voice and how i just made these type of things so here at first we have to install the brushes these three things so after uh, double pressing over there those brush will uh, like extract here uh, if i double press this thing it will open up in a photoshop i'm using photoshop uh, 2019 uh, you can use it uh, 2020 or whatever it is so double press the arb uh, one and you'll get the brush uh, like that so here this brush is done number two this splatter brush and now number three this one double press over here it will add in this photo so this one was the photo now which one i posted in my facebook and other social medias and Tarek Mahmood uh, my uh, younger brother just got this image in one tour which was on the Sri Mangal this design I made from this photo so let's start how to make this one properly at first you have to select the photo you can select it in many ways like you can use the tool or magic one tool or a quick selection tool if you use the quick selection tool it could be better to you or you can use the pen tool as well for the uh, perfection so after selecting that portion uh, you can uh, deselect uh, those portion by pressing alter options and deselect those portion so after selecting that go to the image options go to the adjustment and from here in the threshold portion you will get the threshold option like that and you can uh, adjust the threshold like this okay fine that's good so go to the selection or select options and uh, go to the color range options so which color do you want to keep i want to keep only the black color then i'm using the black options and hit okay so black color is selected press ctrl or command j you'll get the threshold only so after that i'm just deleting that portion and this one is my main thing you can take new artboard how to do that go to the file and taking new and you can take the high res artboard which is uh, 2560 and 1440 and giving the brush effect okay and after that go to the gradient options and you can take the gradient setup like this go to the radial make the angle zero degree reverse and 300 and use the dither and hit ok you can take this one in this window and press ctrl or command t you can make it smaller like this so this type of smaller for the color of the black area now we used wallpaper which is like that you can download that wallpaper from this website i'll give the link in my video description I'm saving that wallpaper and now I'll place over here how to do that go to the file and place embedded and after going to the place options I'll find out that wallpaper from my directory and place over here and after that like this and right press and make it create clipping mask when you making it clipping mask this wallpaper will embed in this portion that means the threshold portion now this one should be like blurry how to do that go to the filter and from the blur gallery or blur gaussian blur and then make it blur yeah make it blur like this 
so you can reposition these things that means the wallpaper uh, press like controller command t and you can make this one like this okay fine and now i'll select these two things that means two layers making it group so this one and this one is our background or gradient and this one is the background and this one is photo and now we'll add um, some uh, effects of the brush for that you have to take new layer new blank layer and then go to the brush option or you can press the b from the keyboard you will find out the splatter brush over here and i'll provide you splatter brush download link in my video description so please find it out so from here, this okay after that you have to take the color from here and like that use like that so after that if you need to change you know, like gradient map you can use the gradient map like this and make it a screen or overlay skin is good and make the fill down and ready so you are getting this type of things that means you are getting the same effects but i made this one without voice uh, those was uh, that was uh, not convenient to learn so that's why i decided to make something um, the popular videos with the voice um, which was not with the voice in previous so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment in my video comment section until the next video i may say i'm signing out today bye bye